So our topic for today's class is hope in hopeless positions. So this position is winning for who, guys? Who's winning? Whites up by two points. Two points. Two points. Two points. Whites up by two points. White has just pushed the pawn forward. But now there is some hope for black because of this move. Can you find out the absolutely shocking move that black played? Both players. This happened in the recently concluded tournament between two top players. One was Wei Yi from the black player was Wei Yi from China, and the white player I forgot his name probably Vincent Kaimer from Germany. So in this position, black has a very good move. Let's see if anybody can find out that. Let's move see if China can find. For black. To defeat China. Let's be quiet. Now is the time to think. No talking at all. After two minutes, we will discuss. He's making noises. Anybody decided? Three people. Let's start with Aaron. Sir, Queen H two. And what do you say, Babe? Sir, sir. What? Queen H two. Why? Oh, okay. First section. What's your move? Queen and five. Queen and five. Black queen here. Black. Then white. it's it's black's turn. White has just played the pawn. If it is white's turn, queen f five is a good move, but you can give a check and then play queen f five. That's the way to win for white. Instead of playing this move, white should have played queen check, king moves, and then queen f five check, and it's an exchange of queens. Two pawns are pawn and game winning. That was the correct way to win for white, but he played pawn push. So now it is black's turn. So wait, why do you play queen h two? Sir, if we play queen h two, then king takes. Then king takes. King takes. Then queen goes to. So why are you giving up a queen? Can you tell us why you are giving up a queen? What is the reasoning behind? What's the reason? Sir, if you give up the, then the reason because giving up the black queen. Huh. The king takes. Hmm. Same. And Adam, same. Same. Both of you did well. Well done. This is not an easy question to understand. The black player Wei from China played queen to h two. Standing move. The first was to king f one. Ah, that's what White played. So we'll continue that. So first, we have to understand why he played it. Black has no moves. If the queen is not there, it is stalemate. So he just gave up the queen. So now White's best move would be not to take it. If you take it, it is stalemate. Right. Still wait, na? No? Yeah. If king takes, so black is no move. F4 will move up. Hmm. What happens? You will find out. Let's continue. Let's ask Arab. Yeah. Sir, queen F2. Queen F2 is a blunder. Who can tell me why queen F2 is a blunder? Wait. Three queen. From which piece? How will we continue? If queen F2, what will we do? Why? Oh, stay with the queen. Yeah. If queen F2, why do we just stay with the queen? <laughs> queen gone. No still wait. So you cannot play queen f two. That's why we have to think before we make decisions. Sir, sir. One second. Now let me. Yes, Rakshir, you have a question. Hmm. Queen g two. Queen g two. What if I again move away to e two? Then you. Hmm. Then you. Then you can take their pawn over there. Again, you're blundering. Queen takes pawn. No, I'm talking about g four. Then king will move, na? No? Sir. Yeah, but at least you get one more pawn. You are already down two pawns. Getting sir, one pawn will not change anything. You will draw the game only if you find the stalemate. Wait. Sir, queen h one. Queen h one. I move my king. Queen e one. Yeah, that's it. So just queen h one or g one. Either move is fine. King will move, and then you just give up your queen. Stalemate. The king has to take it. Here the king cannot refuse. Earlier that's the king could run. This is as far as he can run. That's yeah. That's After. Uh, what happened was after king f1, queen g1, the players agreed to a draw because stalemate was going to happen. After king e2, there was going to be either queen d1 or queen e1. Both moves are fine. Both are draws. 
right? King has to take. Can't go to any of the squares. So, 2700 plus. These are top 20 players in the world. So, in federating, not chess.com. Second, 3000, around 3000, yes. Sir, what about leeches? Hmm? Leeches, how we don't know, it will be something around 3000 plus. Okay, now the second position I'm going to show you. Queen is here, white queen is here, black pawn is here, white pawn here. And it's black So those who found queen next to the idea, well done both of you for finding the stalemate idea. class is missing today. He will come running. Ayun. I think he's uh, coming already. Where are you? No, it's Abhi. Sir, I'm like, uh, where is the FBI person? <laughs> where is Ayun? Sir, Ayun. Sir, Ayun. Sir, Ayun. Sir, we knew that it was going to be stalemate because he's Buddhima. <laughs> and you're Fudhima. <laughs> Shaudiya. Bro, Dad, use it. Sir, I can tell you something. Please. No, no, it's fine. No need to say anything. Please, Abhi, see Dash. Who move is it? Pa patience, patience, patience. Sir, I'm, set, I'm setting the right now. Can you be quiet? I'm setting the position. Please be quiet. Okay. So in this position, the white player actually resigned. This also is a game from the top level. The white player resigned here. So before I give you time to think. It doesn't matter who it's white start, white resign. So before I ask give you time to think, first please tell me why did white resign? Let's ask Ashwik. Sir, because it's pink. So what can we take it? Okay. Oh, very nice. <laughs> Good thinking. Shavriya? Why did white player resign? Sir uh, ah, raise hand and then think about what to say. Yeah, okay. Let me ask Praya. Yes, sir. Why did white resign Praya? Sir, he did not have to resign. He thought that it's a pin. But actually, but yeah, it's actually a pin. First, decide what you're going to say. Yes, While sir. speaking, you're figuring out what to say. That is not what I okay, want. Sir, no, no, that's enough. That's enough. When, I, when you tell an answer, you should first decide what you're going to say. If you don't have an answer, then don't answer. Let me ask Rakshit. Why did White resign? Sir, because the White Queen is taking. If we take Bishop, we take. Yeah, there's a Bishop taking back. So those who already answered till now, you answered without thinking about anything. You just saw pin done. What about Bishop? Nothing. It's resigning time for white because queen is pinned and like next year, the rook is defended. That's why white resigned. Sir, I lost my words. I actually want, I saw the bishop over there protecting zero. Uh -huh. Not lying. Uh -huh. Then why are we looking at you like what to say? Sir, can't you Sir, but there is a bishop. Okay, one second. Yeah, what, I, sorry? Can't you bishop the bishop? You want to put the bishop here? Shavriya, please be quiet. Bishop e6. I'll just take it. If you yeah. give me a piece for free, I'll just take yeah, it for free. Take the knight. How do you take the knight? That knight. Your queen is pinned. You can't move your queen. So if you give up a bishop, you're giving up a bishop for free. Queen is anyway gone. So putting a piece in between will not change anything. It will just make things worse. So now the white player resigned, but this position was actually winning for white. This is where you get three minutes to think and calculate the win for white. Let's see who can do it. From no, no, it's from an actual game. I don't know the players, but it's from an so actual game. Right now, uh -huh, please start thinking. There's no need to worry about yes, players' sir. rating. Let's focus on the position. Why to play? Not just get out of trouble. Why to play and win? No talking, please. No, sir. Oh, okay.
Has anybody decided? Sure. Okay, yes. let's start with the hand. So it's not winning. If it's not winning, then why are you telling? So, but it does get the queen out of trouble. Okay, so you you found a move to get to the queen out of trouble. Okay, what is that move? So, mm -hmm. bishop takes. Bishop takes f seven. King takes. So king takes. Mm -hmm. Rook f one check. King g eight. Oh. Ah, your calculation Six. ended at. Calmness, calmness. We are talking about a line. Those who are not calm will not get their chance. So you stop calculating after rook f one. No. Why? Rook f one. Mm -hmm. I thought queen would rock. Ah, it's easy to win. Now, then you're then you're giving up a bishop, but getting a queen and a rook, and giving up and so not getting a rook. So that's have... one second. So that is winning for you, not just getting out of trouble. You're getting a queen, and you're getting a rook for the queen, and you're giving up a bishop. That's winning an exchange, What's, right? But, but the problem is king will go to g8. One second, one second. Let's ask. No, sir. Direction. Uh, a horse so standing. Bishop e3. Bishop to e3. I take your queen. You can't. Your bishop is pinned. Oh wait. <laughs> the bishop is pinned. So, so that also will not. Ah, uh, you already got a chance. You didn't calculate thoroughly. You calculated two moves. That is not enough. So uh, third move you calculated was a bad move for black. That's not proper calculation. So now who else? Ashwik and Prayan. Yeah. Yeah. This is the position where White resigned. And here White has a winning move, which he didn't play because he resigned. Okay, Prayan. Yes, sir. Bishop takes. King. Can you just show it so that no, 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 no. There's Bishop no need to worry about others. Bishop takes f7. King, king takes. takes. Rook f1. King to g8. Hmm. Rook to uh, f8. Check. Rook takes it. Rook takes and then move queen to g7. And Ashwik, what do you have in mind? Sir, after this castle, sir. Castles is illegal. You can't castle. Mm -hmm. So Prayan was right. Bishop takes f7 is the move. We have to see our activity. Our two bishops are active. Queens active. Queens pin, but it's still active. Right, so even though it's pinned for now, there is still some hope. So king takes is the only move, and now comes what was my answer? Yeah, you can't castle if, if you want to. Even if I you, thought if that. If you could castle, it would be great. But uh, then the king was out of center. Rook f1, king g8. Now comes the important part. This is what you need to see from first. Sad. Getting here, and now you have two ways to win. There are two ways to yeah. Rook f8, rook takes, and then queen g7. Sad. That's one way. There is one more way to win this. Yeah. Can anybody find out the second way to win? I'll give chance to others now. The first method is rook f8, rook takes and queen g7. Are you? Sir, rook captures. Huh? I rook mean captures. the queen captures. Queen takes rook, bishop takes back. And then rook and to then f8. Rook f8. Yeah. So you have two ways. First one is the obvious, I mean, not obvious, but the easier one. Rook f8. Sad rook has to take. And then queen is no longer pinned. Our queen is active. And it makes use of its activity. The other way is... You can just play queen takes rook. Bishop has to take only move, and then rook can play checkmate. So the player just resigned without sir, finding any of that. Yeah. Sir, while I'm thinking, I'm just hearing him. He's just eating. <laughs> <laughs> so if it disturbs <laughs> people, we'll have to stop Ryan from bringing stuff to class. Please stop. <laughs> Eat your snacks and then come to class. Or eat without making noise. That's all. Anyway. Next position. Yeah, the third and Three. final position. So our topic for those who have hadn't come at the right time was is what's the topic for today? Why want to design? Why kind of, of the hope? Why of hope. the hope? Hope, hope of the hope. Huh? Hope of the hope. What is hope of the hope? You don't make sense also, no? When you speak. Yeah. Give yes. hope when there's no hopelessness. When? Uh, <laughs> give when hope when there's no hopelessness. When Okay, it's just so hope. hope in positions that look hopeless, there is still some hope if you look for it. So, like in these two positions that we just saw, I there was hope. It. Only if you look for it. Hope if you look for it. Hope if you look for it. No, if you do not look for it, we are hopeless. That you have. That I agree. I am hope. So love you. You are hopeful. I am hopeful. You are hopeless because you do not have hope. But they these stupid people. <laughs> okay, this is our third and final position. Ah, uh, you can keep it there. I think it's outside. I think I have checkmates. Okay. 
Okay, now Check. everybody silence, silence. So this is our third position. White has just played rook h7, and to his horror, he saw that the bishop, the bishop comes to f5, and it's a fork. And here the white player resigned. But he shouldn't have. He shouldn't have. <laughs> white was still in a. Let me. How did you find the answer? Why are you drawing drama? <laughs> If I ask you now, you will say Baba Baba. <laughs> first, understand the position. Na? Understand the position, then check your options, then make a decision, and then start jumping up and down. There is no need to jump up and down now. So, so I said so, that he shouldn't resign because, well, because. I expected that he shouldn't resign. That oh. was all. Now, that way, we understood yeah. that, of course. So, here, hello, Pranith, you are right on time today. So, in this position, White has a move that gets him out of trouble. Can you find out that move for White? You have three minutes. A move to get out of trouble. No talking for three minutes. This is the toughest of the three questions today. <laughs> Most people would resign here because our rook is gone. No, sir. You will not resign here. No, no. Mm -hmm. No, I'll ask help from you, but you already know. Okay. <laughs> In a tournament. Yes, sir. You will get both of us disqualified. You will also disqualified. No, sir. You can talk to anyone while playing in a tournament. Sir, if you. Sir, you will get disqualified if you tell him the answer. No, no. Only you, when you are playing a tournament game, if you talk to anybody... Sir, you guys are giving me the authority. No, sir. Like, if he, if you are playing a game, mm -hmm. and then he leaves his chair and tells you, so what's the answer to this position? If you don't say anything, you are not going to get disqualified, right? If I don't say anything, I won't get it. But he will get disqualified, no? Because he... Sir, what if I stop talking to somebody else? Sir, may I Yep, sure, please. Silence, everybody. Those who haven't completed taking, please think. Sir, I never knew we didn't have freedom to speech. Well, over here, you do have the right to invoke the fees. Oh my god, ouch. So, how many of you decided? Hmm. One, two, three, four. Let's start with prayer. Yes, sir. Nine to D3 blocking the and chair. Uh, okay, if I take with the rook, your rook is still hanging. Uh, you didn't think of yeah. that. Yes, sir. Then I you thought of that. Yes, sir. You thought of that already. Yes, sir. And oh, then I move my uh, rook to. Huh. Once again. Uh, oh. Wait. Yeah, rook to. Rook to. Uh, you already decided. No, why are you? B seven. Rook to B seven. I move my rook with a check. Ah, there goes the rook. Rook to B seven. Yes. Yeah. Why do you want to take it with the rook so you can Sir, take the rook to B seven. Then he will. Then he has already decided what to do. Sir. And he's right. We'll get to that later. One second. One second. But Shall if you move the rook to B7, then the rook will just take the rook. Rook is on. Rook. No, it's a check. It's a check from Bishop. Okay. And rook. So, Shaurya, what is your move? Sir, 9 to D3. 9 to D3. And if I take with the Bishop? The no, I'm asking Shaurya. Sir, if I take with the Bishop, King to B2. And if I take your rook? After king I take yeah, so that is the original idea, right? Most of you would have found it. Knight to d3 is the move to play here. The first line to understand is if bishop takes knight, then king b2, and when rook gets taken, we get his rook. So and I that's a draw. Right no, no, I said get out of trouble. I didn't say winning position. White cannot win this. White can get out of trouble. You are still in big trouble. No, how? 
Bishop no. takes king b2, that's a draw position. No, black is an extra pawn. Oh, wait, okay, okay. So, wait. One second. Oh. Black, oh, wait, one second. Huh? Black is Oh, sorry, sorry. This pawn is not there. My bad. <laughs> sorry. It doesn't change the main evaluation of the position, but yeah. In some lines, it will matter. So, the pawn is not there. So, knight d3, bishop takes, king b2, bishop takes, king takes is a draw. Because black has a bishop and white has just a pawn. Yeah. Right? So, that is the first line to understand. This one. If bishop takes, we just play king b2. And when bishop takes rook, we take the rook. Draw. Right? Now, the main, the more important thing to understand is, what happens if rook takes knight? Because your rook is still hanging. So, that's where Prayan got stuck. He played rook b7. I just played rook b3 and got his rook. Rook f7? I play rook b7. So right now, white is still okay. under under the pump. There's a there's a bishop looking at your rook. There's a threat to the rook. And there's a discovered attack on your king. Anytime. So wherever your rook hides, my rook will come and get yes, you. Sir. Oh, so oh, oh. where will you hide? Rook okay. Rook h4. Oh, rook h4. Huh? Rook h4, king g5. And then? Rook h4 is good. That's the only square. <laughs> That's a check. King g5. Sir, rook h4. Sir, if you play rook h3, then it will be Sorry, sorry. Where, where? In which position do you want to play rook h3? This was a position. Rook h4 is what Abir told. You were saying rook h3. I just take the rook. So, rook h4 is correct. King will go to g5. Now, where will you hide your rook? Your rook is still hanging. Rook is still hanging and there is a discord attack with my rook. So where do you hide your rook? Wait. Sir, pawn push. Pawn push. I take your rook. That's how you're going to save your rook. And by giving up it for free. Sir, this so is let's take one minute to think. Here there is a resource for white. White has a way to uh, hide somewhere. Sir, can you give us a key? Let's, let's look at it for one minute. Then we'll understand. Okay. All right, let's see. No talking. Anybody? Okay. Wave? Sir, rook to c4. What will black do, Wave? Sir, rook goes to c4. Then hmm. Rook go to... Hmm. Sir. You don't think of what black will do. <laughs> then how do you make a decision in chess without Sir, thinking one more? No. One second. When you're saying a move or playing a move, you should know what will happen next. If you're not even thinking about what happens next, then this, that's not a proper decision. Anyone else decided? Prayan? Sir, rook c4 is not correct. That because? Happens. Sir, because then you, you uh, I can play c3 yeah, or, or d4. Yeah, or d4. So that's a simple blunder. Sir, rook h1. If you're saying rook c4, you haven't thought anything. Yes. Rook h1, sir. Rook h1. What will black do? What will black do, Pranit, after rook h1? Sir, uh, sir after black, uh, after the rook comes, it's basically it's kind of the same thing, sir. What will you, if you're black, what, can you find a move for black? After rook h1. There's no move, good move for black. Rook to b3. There's no better move. No. Why can't I play rook d1? Sir, if you play rook d1, my rook will... Uh... When your king is in check. That's the whole point of all this, no? <laughs> the whole point is there's a discovered attack, right? That's why your rook is trying to hide. If you just want to save your rook, you can put it there only, no? Yeah. It's not that king is afraid of a check from rook. King is afraid because black will move the rook and take your rook. Oh. That's why rook wants to hide. So rook h1 doesn't do anything. Rook h3 and I take your rook. Or rook d1 and I take your rook. So who can, who has found it? Yes, Shavya. Sir, rook 2. Huh. Rook 2, h2. And then what will black do, Shavya? Rook 2. Rook 2. Then what will you do, Shavya? Then I'll take your rook, no, Shavya. <laughs> so yeah, that's still not hiding anywhere, no? 
So even if you go to H2, I'll play rook H3. So, so how does it? Us the, the clue is in my think about the first position we had. We used stalemate no, as an idea. Okay, okay, fine. In the first position, we had a stalemate trick. So you you have to use stalemate also here. So your king is almost out of squares. So does the position end in stalemate? Yeah, you have to get a position that is stalemate. Like it has to be part of it. So the king has lots of squares. Exactly. So we have to make sure there is not that many squares. And so even if you give up your rook or the pawn, mm -hmm. you can play the king. So it's a very difficult move. Even if we get till here. Like after rook takes all this rook h4 king g5, even here it's a very difficult move to find because it, as Ahan said, king has lot of squares, no? C1, d1, c2, b2, a2. So, so how will stalemate? Squares and you have two pieces. Yeah, two pieces also there. You can't give up two pieces, right? The idea is rook h2. Now Shauri will jump up and say, "I told rook h2." Correct? <laughs> okay. But the idea is what happens after? After Black plays rook h3, we calmly play. A1. King to A1. A1 chips. But then black will just take your rook, right? Can you find a drawing move here for white? White to play and make a draw. Aha. 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 If you have the answer, then raise your hand. Shaurya. Sir, we move the pawn to F4. Aha. I'm asking Shaurya. You'll get minus one. Yes, Shaurya. Pawn to F3. Pawn to F3. How is pawn f3 draw? Not pawn f3, pawn f4. Oh, uh, well, let me ask, who else had the answer? No one. Okay, yeah. Sai Krishna. Pawn f4. Yeah, you have to play pawn f4. Because you have to get pawn... rid of your pawn basically. So you have to block your pawn. Yeah, block or get rid of it. Right, so pawn f4 and now if king moves or king takes, it's a draw. If you simply play pawn f3, I'll play some normal move like rook back, rook x3 and I'll take your pawn. And it's going to be a win for black. So pawn f4. Now it's a draw because black, white has no moves. Black can take or move, doesn't matter because after black moves, it's still it. White cannot go anywhere, still it. So now we are going to start our oh, games, guys. Sir, sir.